Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you all a lip balm haul. I'm soon going to be uploading the best and worst lip balms, so I purchased a couple of them from Amazon so that I can make another video with all the other lip balms that I have. So the first one is super affordable. It's from Blue Heaven. It's called their Lip Balm. And this one is in the variant uh, Strawberry. It's quite thick. I have used it. Um, I'm just going to give you a quick review even though I'll be talking about it more in my other video. But yeah, it's not something that I would prefer. Although it's super affordable, the style is quite the EOS type. But hmm. the next affordable lip balm that I got is from Swiss Beauty. It's their Kiss beauty kiss candy lip balm in the variant peach now everybody says it's a dupe of lineage i will compare this i've got the lineage one as well i chose the peach one but they've got like coffee and berry and all those colors as well this is actually very affordable and it's more like a gloss rather than a nourishing lip balm but it smells good and lasts pretty long as well so yeah this was the other lip balm that i purchased moving on we've got this lip oil because it's like lip balm as well as lip oil both this one is from blue heaven and it's an affordable one now i've already got a couple of expensive lip oils that i'll share in my next video but this one is the affordable one i went for the clear one but you can definitely find a lot of different colors in them blue heaven is actually upping their game i must say i really really like this lip oil i have also got their lip balm which i'll show you in the next video you would have already seen in my videos before but i'm really impressed with the way blue heaven is revamping and you know reformulating their products so quite impressed with this lip oil the next lip balm is super affordable it's essentials by foxtail so it's like a sub you know range from foxtail it's the nourishing lip balm in coco my god the smell of this lip balm is so good and honestly i love the cute simple packaging super affordable and this lip balm is so good guys i'm already impressed so i purchased two three more items from this foxtails range because it is so affordable i'll be reviewing them soon so make sure you subscribe to my channel but guys this lip balm is so good they have two three more variants in different flavors you can check it out but i love this coco one this cocoa butter one is like super essential so yeah the next lip balm that i got is the classic vaseline lip therapy original care now this is something that i wanted to add in my video honestly i have used multiple vaseline products from their lip oils uh, you know the glossy vaseline lip gloss oil from the vaseline petroleum jelly cocoa butter to these lip therapy ones and those tube ones as well no matter what i feel vaseline is more like a topical product it really doesn't nourish your lips or skin it's just to create a barrier although this works well to ensure your perfume lasts longer but yeah i got it for the review purposes it's okay there are some people who love vaseline there are some people who hate it then i've got this newly launched Dermacos lip balm this one is the ceramide lip balm with spf i love any and every product with ceramides because it's so nourishing honestly i found this packaging super cute it comes in this capsule form very compact and this lip balm is you know enriched with your actives that'll give you proper protection or you can say nourishment at the same time benefits of lip balm it is a little hard but once you start rubbing it it'll melt it's very nice hydrating honestly it's like the classic doctor lip balm and not like your beauty lip balm so yeah dermaco did a great job they also have kojic acid lip balm for your pigmented lips so that's a great thing i really like their way of you know promoting products next i again purchase this for the video purposes this one is the plum candy melts caramel lip balm now i've had love hate relationship with plum lip balms the one that i had was red velvet and i had to throw it it was so bad i heard that they reformulated it and they've launched like two more flavors out of which one was the caramel one and i love sweet sugary fragrances so i had to get this one it's okay i have just used it once i still need to review it properly so that i can share it with you all in my next video but it's fine i really like the smell it's not too sugary but 
um plum lip balms are a bit disappointment so let's see where this one goes hopefully they have updated it but the packaging is pretty similar and i'm not sure the other variant is it's something sweet one as well but i went for the caramel cravings one and yeah these lip balms are affordable now moving on to the next lip balm which is the Laneige lip balm this one is the tube form not the top form i will talk about the top form as well in my upcoming video which i love now i know there are a lot of uh, speculations and things going around that Laneige is not a cruelty free brand and even i was hurt by that fact but this is a lip balm that i had purchased long time back and um, yeah i wanted to review it for you all Honestly, I have nothing bad to say about it except for the cruelty part. But um, yeah, it's it's an amazing product. Honestly, my mom loves it. And if you compare it with the Kiss Beauty um, Swiss Beauty Kiss Candy Lip Balm, you honestly cannot compare it. You can't directly dupe it, but it's good. I mean, if you are okay with the cruelty thing, then you should just straight away purchase this one. But leaving all that aside, coming to my new favorite product that I found. I am so grateful that I found this. It's from this, you know, indie small brand called Dam Beauty or Dam Beauty D I A M, and this one is their glass tint lip balm. Now, first of all, I'm sure you all know those viral clicker lip balms that are going, you know, from Rare Beauty, Fenty, and all. I wanted that you don't get here in India, but when they launched it and I saw it on Amazon, I was like, I need it. I I got it in the variant peach moonstone and it's a beautiful peachy neutral color. I love it. Okay, you have to click it and you have to ensure you click it very less because once you click it it doesn't go back. But it's that super hydrating glossy lip balm that you see on TikTok. This is so good. It's slightly expensive, but I'm going to purchase more of their colors because I loved it. Very hydrating. It smells a little weird. I'm not going to lie, but it's so good. But I know it's a small growing brand, so I'm excited to see their other products as well. But if you really want to try it, do try this lip balm it's so 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 good i leave the links below so this was my lip balm haul video in my upcoming video i'm going to be sharing with you all the best and worst lip balms and it's going to be like a lip balm worth 3000 to a lip balm worth 30 rupees so make sure you subscribe to my channel to watch that video and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do then make sure you give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'll see See you guys in my next video.